If you are somebody that struggles with emotional eating, eating, binge eating, uh, binging and restricting, mindlessly eating, if you kind of dissociate when you eat and then after you're like, oh my God, what have I done? This is for you, keep watching. Earlier I was eating, I made this delicious salad. I'm about to post the recipe so it will be up soon, but I made this dis delicious salad. It is full of tons of nutrients, vegetables, homemade dressing that isn't too calorically dense, full of a ton of protein, really filling and just full of a lot of good stuff. It is the epitome of health in a salad. And earlier I was eating the salad and then I got full from the salad and part of my brain lit up or something inside me lit up and it was like, you must finish eating the entire salad. You have to eat the whole thing. It is healthy. It is good for you. You have to have a clean plate. Well, my story for you today is that you don't need to have a clean plate. You need to listen to your hunger cues. You need to listen to your body and what it is telling you. I don't care if you have the healthiest meal in the world. If you are somebody that is wounded and you are somebody that turns to food as a place of emotional support, if you're somebody that lacks control around food and can't be there fully intentionally for every single meal, then you need to learn to listen to your body. And the more you can do that, the more you can learn to trust yourself and the more you can distance yourself from those behaviors that are keeping you stuck.